Amazon.com lists the 10 worst Halloween treats as follows. Apples, candy corn, toothbrushes, popcorn balls, raisins, Tootsie Rolls, pennies, and bit of honey? I think peanut brittle should be in there, don't you? If you're going to eat candy this Halloween, I've been eating it for the past two weeks, you need to know about the four basic food groups. Sticky, sweet, fatty, and salty. With sticky, you get tooth decay and eventually periodontal disease. Fatty turns you into one while clogging up your arteries. Sweet has the same problems as sticky and fatty, just on a slower timetable. And salty hikes your blood pressure and beats on your kidneys like punching bags. But paranoia aside, you're not likely to explode from a one-night candy binge. Oh yes, you are. I think the key word here is binge. Now I could tell you to read the label on every little bonbon you pop in your mouth, but <laughs> what's the point? None of them are really good for you anyway. And you know it. Our philosophy is this. If you're going to eat something that's slowly going to start eating you from the inside out, it should at least be something you enjoy. I mean, why suck in all those calories if it's something you really don't like that much in the first place? Just remember it's a treat, not your staple diet. And then enjoy a little bit of it. Life's too short to eat peanut brittle. And if you do it just because someone gives it to you, it's bound to be just that much shorter. Don't feel guilty. Just put the candy corn in the trash. It wasn't made for people anyway. I think it was made for artificial animals. Or... Orcs. <laughs> Couldn't think of anything. We left you a link to the Center for Science in the Public Interest. It has all sorts of information about the candy you're about to decide to not not enjoy.